The days are longer and dust and other messes are getting pretty noticeable, noticeable probably in your house. So it may be time to kind of brighten some things up you're feeling. So we turn to one expert at Consumer Reports who is laser focused on finding the products that work and the ones that don't so that you can get your spring cleaning done without stress and on a budget. Jodaira Rodriguez does not mess around when it comes to cleaning, and for good reason. She's a Consumer Reports writer who has tested glass cleaners, DIY cleaning hacks, steam cleaners, and more. You don't need a ton of products to get your house clean. Some basic things like a multi-purpose cleaner, a glass cleaner, a bathroom cleaner, and maybe something that's a disinfectant. Vinegar can be a great option if you don't want to spend money on a dedicated glass cleaner. But Consumer Reports tests found Sprayway glass cleaner earned top marks and is also an economical choice because it also cleans chrome, tile, and porcelain. Vinegar or dish detergent can also help remove mild mold and mildew buildup. Of course, there are tools you can buy to make some jobs easier and maybe even more fun, if that's your thing. Consumer Reports recently tried the Bissell Steam Shot. The Bissell Steam Shot is so satisfying to use. It cleaned up my bathroom grout really, really well. If you don't need to deep clean, but you have lots of areas to cover, consider a power scrubber like this $56 battery-powered Liebine to keep things moving. To tackle the dust and cobwebs in all those hard-to-reach places, Consumer Reports says turn to your vacuum's attachments for help. The crevice tool for tight spaces and the upholstery tool to deep clean your couch. But the key is having a vacuum with adequate airflow. Consumer Reports tests for that and says this $250 Kenmore delivers. Or consider a powerful hand vac like this $90 Black & Decker, which comes with different attachment tools for cleaning edges like stair steps and tight spaces. And one last cleaning tip. Take it room by room. You can do your bathroom today, bedrooms tomorrow, closets the day after that. It's much easier to work in small groups that way. And you don't get overwhelmed by it all, right? So to cut down on paper towel waste and save some money, Consumer Reports also recommends microfiber cloths that you can wash and then reuse. And if you get them in different colors, then you can assign each color to a specific room so you can keep bathroom germs away from kitchen germs. Be sure to join us tomorrow at this time. We're continuing the conversation for spring cleaning. If you need a new vacuum, I know we just mentioned a couple, but Consumer Reports testers have been busy making messes and cleaning them up, really trying uprights, canisters, stick vacs. We're going to show you the vacuums for every lifestyle and for every budget. And then on Friday, if something's going on with your washing machine, you may be wondering, ah, should I repair it? or should I replace it? What you should check before you start shopping for a new one, find out Friday in the eight o'clock hour of the morning show.